Hello Gemini and welcome to your October 2020 reading. Okay, um, I hope you liked the video at the start. I've got some diaries coming out. Um, there's two diaries as you would have seen in the advert. One is called Spirit Messages and the other is called Gratitude and the Spirit Messages is sort of a, just a blank diary with um, messages at the start of um, every month and then gratitude there's a page at the start of every month where you can sort of go back throughout the month and write down all the things that you're grateful for throughout the month okay um you know if you're into that sort of thing it's nice to stay in that positive frame of mind so the gratitude one helps you you know stay in that uh, positivity Okay, Gemini, so I was asking what the month ahead holds for you and two cards fell out and it was the world card and the chariot. So to me, it's like, you know, you can make a choice. You can have the world if you want it. Um, you know, like the choice is yours. What are you going to choose? So there seems to be a choice for you in the month of October, Gemini, where you can have the world, uh, which could possibly be, you know, something in particular that you want which would make your world it can be you know all the options you want sort of available to you let's spread these out but the choice is yours so you are the one who's uh, in control of the decision which can bring you this wow so it looks like possible changes for you Gemini <laughs> all these cards jumping out at once and look what's come out already quite interestingly enough you've got the seven of swords the six of cups the two of pentacles the sun the knight of cups the ace of swords and the magician now I've already said that this is you who's got to make this decision and you've got the magician card come out there so already I can see these cards are backing up um what i sort of felt for you the cards that fell out early when i was asking for your message ahead um this card here as soon as i looked at it it's like running away with it um you've got this opportunity to run with something you know this card often means something else but as i'm looking at it i'm feeling something different um are you going to run with it gemini are you going to make a decision are you going to run with it this can bring you happiness we've got the six of cups here that's like celebration um um coming together okay so there's something that you need to sort of go with run with it's possibly something you've been thinking of for a long time um you know you, you've got this decision it's almost like if you don't do it somebody else could because you've got this person here in this card grabbing these swords and running off with it and that is kind of what this card normally means it's like um careful someone don't take something from you so there seems to be an opportunity or a decision where if you don't go with it gemini somebody else could okay so there's something for you which if you don't take um the chance or the opportunity somebody else could have it okay so we've got this other card here about sort of family celebrations and getting together so there seems to be some of that going on as well and here we go there's the decision now we said earlier with that chariot that you'd got a choice or a decision to make and it's come out again um you're being given a message here about going out and enjoying yourself getting out there in the sun go out have some fun um so don't let this tie you down um this decision you do need to be getting out there and enjoying yourself okay now you've got the knight of cups here and they often are messages and offers um so again we've got this decision we've got this offer something coming to you and it's like somebody's just coming over and handing it to you he's coming up here on his horse and he's holding his hands out it's, it's like something's just gonna fall in your lap it's just gonna be handed to you and it's a new start look gemini we've got this um ace of swords here now their beginnings um ace of swords can also mean uh, like a worry or a concern um it could be what uh 
you want to run with, what you want to think about. This offer that's coming could also bring you a little bit of worry and concern, but you don't need to worry too much because look what you've got next to it. You've got the magician card. You've got all the tools you need. So you've got a decision which could bring you the world. So that could make your life so much better, Gemini. But are you going to run with it? Are you going to go for it? Are you going to make that decision? And then you could be the king of wands, okay, at the end there. Um, now he is about taking your time. So you don't need to rush this decision. Um, but there's something coming up in the month of October for you. And there we go. Practice makes perfect. So it may be, if I can pick up the card here and show you, practice makes perfect. Is it that you've done this before, Gemini? Is it that you keep trying and it doesn't seem to work? Is it that you may have to try this more than once? Okay, so this could mean a different thing for some of you if there is something that you keep trying something which would make you happy which would make your world it could be that that opportunity is coming for you again this month so even if there's something coming up that you know you've tried before and it didn't work but this is something that you want take that opportunity you know um practice makes perfect there's definitely an opportunity coming for you it's a decision a choice and it can bring you what you want and the practice makes perfect so quite possibly you've tried before with this okay gemini so what is this that you keep wanting you keep trying and you have probably going to have it fall in your lap again this month or the opportunity and choice for it okay and are you going to go for it again celebration there we go perhaps if you didn't get it last time perhaps if it was something that didn't work it may you know you may succeed this month you may get it and it may work okay because you've got the celebration card then we said before that there was some sort of family celebration coming up and we've got it again here so practice makes perfect keep trying gemini whatever it is something is coming for you this month but it's going to be your decision looks like it's coming towards you it's coming for you but it's your decision so this is, isn't something that you're forced to do okay so for those of you where this um isn't to do with your relationship we've got some romance angel cards here um, again if you like these readings remember to hit the like and subscribe it is free to subscribe and in the description below, I will put the link to the diaries. The diaries are not actually out yet. Um, they're in the process of being released and hopefully it'll be another week or so. Um, so I'll put the link there so you can keep checking if you're interested and have a look at those later and a link also to pendulum video that I recorded about a month ago. Okay, oh, here we go, Gemini. Pay attention to red flags. The signs are causing. Okay, Gemini, so we just ran into some um, technical difficulties. So you've got paying attention to red flags. The signs are cautioning you. Okay, so there may be something going on where you could have an argument. Um, you know, you, you see a problem and you kind of ignore it or let it go on or something. Okay, then we've got deception. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. So again, another little warning. Perhaps it could be that you ask their advice on something and they tell you and then afterwards they say, oh, well, I didn't really think that. So, you know, just be careful. Probably don't ask their advice or in, include them in something that you, you know, you don't want it to go particularly wrong. And then you got keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. So for those of you who are single, it may be that you need to keep an open mind this month. The opportunity to meet someone is coming up, but it may not be your usual type. Okay, Gemini, so I hope you've enjoyed those readings. And um, sorry for the technical difficulties. Um, at least we got right to the end before it happened. And um, I hope you've enjoyed your reading and I'll see you again next month. Thank you for watching.